Hey y'all, I know we touch on some pretty heavy subjects, but one thing that seems to be an area of which there is an immense curiosity is healthy relationships. That makes me excited <laughs> because that means you are building self-awareness around what you want and don't want to see in a relationship. And that is a really good thing. And the pandemic we're currently in, according to statistics, because you know I like my numbers, is ushering in a large number of people who are giving additional thought to the approach they are taking in deciding who will be their significant others. To this news, I say, yeah, <laughs> we are finally getting on the right track and realizing the importance of having a healthy relationship. So I'm going to quickly give you three realistic signs you're in a healthy relationship. Number one, you don't care what others think about your relationship. Yes, as the saying goes, comparison is the thief of joy, and this relates to relationships too. The day you start comparing your relationship to other relationships or trying to keep up with what another couple is doing is the day you set yourself up for disappointment. No relationship is perfect. Every relationship has its challenges, and this is why you have to create the dynamic that works for the two of you and stick with it. Number two. You have learned how to manage your differences and conflicts in a way that honors and strengthens your relationship. Every couple, no matter who, will have their differences. You will be ticked off at your significant other and you will tick them off too. It's normal, we're human and imperfect and with those factors, things can get messy even in the happiest of relationships. Wedding photographers uh, participating in a survey and they could tell which marriages were doomed from the start. They could predict it pretty well by one simple gesture they observed in couples, even on their wedding day. It was how the couples interacted, helped each other, and dealt with their conflicts. Yes, even on a wedding day, couples were having some conflicts, surprise, surprise, as it could be one of your happiest days but stressful days too. It's how you handle the hard stuff that is a telltale sign of whether you can make it and if you do it in a way that is respectful of your partner. Number three, you like your partner for who they are in this moment right now. Once you have acquired some dating experience and you've had a few challenging relationships, you start to realize the importance of liking someone for who they are in the specific moment. It doesn't mean you will like everything about them, but you accept and value them for exactly who they are, not who you think they will become. So there you have it, I've given you three realistic signs you're in a healthy relationship. If you want to learn more about how to cultivate a healthy relationship, you can visit thenewrulesofdating.com to learn more about my relationship coaching services. Until next time, XOXO.